Hello everyone, I'm Major Vel. Welcome to my channel. Today I teach you to make this nice poncho with sleeves. The size is for a two-year-old girl. You can do it as big as you want. You can do it as big as you want. I've put some fringes. I have combined it in three colors, but you can do it with just one. If you want to make it bigger three, four or five years, you have to increase two stitches every round. If you want adult size, increase three stitches in each round. I hope you liked it. In my blog I leave you a small graphic pattern. Contour 58 cm or 22.8 inches. Length 16 cm or 6.2 inches. Start with 80 chains. Take the measure of the contour of the head. It has to go through the head. Join with slip stitch. One round. Five chains. One double crochet in the same stitch. Forty double crochet. Once you have 40 double crochet, 2 chains, 1 double crochet in the same stitch. Thirty nine double crochet. In each part, you have to have forty one double crochet, including the three star chains. It is important that the stitches are odd. Finish round with slip stitch. Two round. One slip stitch. Three chains. One double crochet. Two chains. 
in the same stitch. 2 double crochet. One round we increase two double crochet and another round one double crochet. One front post triple crochet. 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 One double crochet. Continue sequence until you reach the corner. If you started with one front post triple crochet, you have to finish the same. One front post triple crochet. In the corner. Two double crochet, two chains, two double crochet in the same stitch. One front post triple crochet. One double crochet. 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 Continue sequence until the end of the round. If you started with one front post triple crochet, you have to finish the same. One front post triple crochet. Finish round with slip stitch. Two slip stitch. Color change.
three round. Five chains. One double crochet in the same stitch. In this round where you have done the double crochet you have to do one front post triple crochet and vice versa. Look closely at the sequence you have from the previous round. The sequence you already know. Too easy. One double crochet one front post double crochet. One double crochet. One front post triple crochet. One double crochet. One front post triple crochet. One double crochet. One front post triple crochet. Continue sequence until you reach the corner. In the corner. One double crochet. Two chains. One double crochet. In the same stitch. One double crochet. One front post triple crochet. One double crochet. One front post triple crochet. One double crochet. One front post triple crochet. Continue sequence until the end of the round. Look closely at the sequence you have from the previous round. Finish round with slip stitch. Color change. One slip stitch. Three chains. One double crochet. Two chains. In the same stitch. Two double crochet. One round we increase two double crochet and another round one double crochet. Repeat these two rounds until you get the necessary measure. I have worked for 13 rounds, 14 centimeters or 5.5 inches. I'm done with 79 stitches in each part. If you have two stitches or so, no matter.
I have divided in front 44 stitches, 35 and 35 sleeves and 44 back. From the peak up it counts 22 stitches and mark. Count 35 sleeve stitches and mark. Count 22 stitches to the peak and mark. On the other side do the same. Color change. We continue to increase in the same way. Three chains. One double crochet. Two chains. In the same stitch. Two double crochet. One round we increase two double crochet and another round one double crochet. Look closely at the sequence you have from the previous round. One front post triple crochet. One double crochet. One front post triple crochet. One double crochet. One front post triple crochet. Continue sequence until you reach the marker. Make 5 chains and skip the sleeve. Always following the stitch sequence. Skip the sleeve. One double crochet. One front post triple crochet. Continue sequence until you reach the marker. Make 5 chains and skip the sleeve. Always following the stitch sequence. Skip the sleeve. One double crochet. Continue sequence until the end of the round. Now we are going to work the body. Always following the stitch sequence. Color change. Five chains. One double crochet in the same stitch. One 
One double crochet. One front post triple crochet. One double crochet. One double crochet in each chain. Five double crochet. In the chains follow the stitch sequence. On the other side repeat the same. One double crochet in each chain. Five double crochet. In the chains follow the stitch sequence. Continue the sequence until you have the necessary measure. I have worked for 12 rounds, 13 centimeters or 5 inches, to make the sleeves. Start in the middle stitch of the 5 chains we did. Always following the stitch sequence. Three chains. Always following the stitch sequence. One double crochet. One front post triple crochet. One double crochet. If you have put 35 stitches on the sleeves, you have to be 40.
Continue sequence until the end of the round. Color change. Finish round with slip stitch. Decrease one stitch at the beginning and another at the end every three rounds. Three chains. Two double crochet cluster. Continue sequence until the end of the round. Finish the round with two double crochet cluster. Color change. Decrease one stitch at the beginning and another at the end every three rounds. In this round you just have to follow the stitch sequence. Take the first triple crochet front post from the previous round. Decrease one stitch at the beginning and another at the end every three rounds.
I have worked for 12 rounds, 13 centimeters or 5 inches. Do 3 rounds on the elastic stitch cuff. Three chains. One back post double crochet. One front post double crochet. One back post double crochet. One front post double crochet. One back post double crochet. One front post double crochet. One back post double crochet. One front post double crochet. Continue sequence until the end of the round. Finish round with slip stitch. Three chains. One back post double crochet. One front post double crochet. Work this round and one more. For the fringes, I have cut 12 centimeters or 4.7 inches of wool. Divide in half and put in the last round with the hook. I hope you liked it. Thank you very much for seeing me. See you in the next tutorial.